everybody. Now this uh, Design Spark mechanical demo is very precious. Well, it is to me, and here's why. Okay, first V to make the sketch grid faces. Now I don't like these pale sections at either side. I want the screen full with the grid so that I can see it easily. So the way I do this is select the construction line tool over here and then draw a line from that corner right across to this corner here. That makes the grid visible on the whole page. Now I can select the three point arc and make an arc one, two, three, an arc. Straight line four by ten by four. And now we can put some corners on. Finally, we need a construction line in the center of our ring. And that's all we need in the sketch plane. We now go to the pull tool, which puts us in 3D mode. We can select the revolve tool over here, click it. We now have a revolve tool in our mouse cursor. The first thing we do is select the, the center of the revolve, the face we want to revolve, left click and drag, left click, drag and nothing happens. Now I've discovered that that is because both the face and the center of the thing is parallel with the surface of the screen. So if we simply click the middle mouse button and rotate it a bit, we find now if we left click and drag, it all happens. We've now got our ring. It's green at the moment. And now we can delete this line if we want to, delete. And to make it a nice gold colour, we go to the display tab, select the surface of the ring by going to the structure tree, click the solid, that selects the whole surface. The colour icon there opens up and I've got a, a gold colour here I've already custom made so we select the gold colour. Now the surface texture can be specified over here this sphere, little sphere thing. We want to make it metallic and we want the finish to be high gloss. So now we have a high gloss ring which looks quite nice. The only thing being that we've got these black lines which we can't get rid of. Now that's because of the method we've used to construct the ring. If we want a ring without any black lines we can use a different method. So if we start again file new Design V. We'll, we'll use our full screen again. We choose spline. And this time we draw a spline.
Now we've got a concave piece here which I don't like. So we can remove that by selecting the Move tool. And dragging that until it is more or less straight or slightly convex. I like that. So that's our section for the ring. We want an axis, so we select the construction line again, put an axis in. Now we can select the pull tool. Revolve that, that. Now we know that we've got the aligner, so middle mouse button and drag a bit. Now the left mouse button and we drag it around until it mates up. Now, as you can see, we've got a ring here without any lines around it. <coughs> so to finish it off, we will select the solid, our colour, metallic, finish, eye gloss, H, home key, and if we go back to design, select, select that, delete that, H key again, there we are. we've now got a ring with no lines on and it is beautiful. I want one. Hope you like that. Hope it can be useful. Please subscribe. Bye.